Hey everyone, welcome to another texture tutorial. In this case, since many people have been asking how to create multiple textures for the bow and having troubles with that, I will explain it from zero. This tutorial will be much faster than the previous one because I already explained the basics stuff. So let's create the texture pack. Assets. Okay. Models and textures. Item. And here we have the bow.json. I will search it here because I already explained it. Mm. This is the bow.json. So let's create it. And there we have in custom model data one. We will have the first custom texture and then from here we will have the another texture how this works this part is for the normal bow this part until here is for the custom bow of custom model data one and this part will be for custom model data two so let's change Okay, so okay, the custom model data one, the model file will be called custom one, custom one, and custom one, and the custom model data two will be called custom two, custom two, custom two, and custom two. Okay, how this works. We are telling bow.json that if it has custom model data one, it will search for the model located in item. We are in item, then in bow, and then the file called custom one bow. What is that file? For to do textures, I I left the stuff here, but. Um, if you're creating a 3D model, for example, well, it's the JSON you create in the 3D model. If you have trouble with that, I can also create that tutorial. So it's called custom one bow dot JSON. Okay, let's copy here. I will Perfect. Custom one bow, and let's copy this four times because we are searching for four type of files. This one, this one, this one, this one. So the next name is this, then this. And then this. And what are these files doing? They are searching for the texture of the bow. How can we take it without creating them? Well, I already explained it, that, but no problem. First of all, let's create the path textures, then item, then bow. And normal state. Okay, let's change the names. Normal state, normal state. Zero, one, and two. Those are, those are the name of the textures. Where are we going to? Where are we going to get the textures? Here. In versions, in 
No. Here, let's open this with WinRAR. Let's go to assets, Minecraft textures, item, and let's search for bow. And here we have. But those are not the names we want. It's normal state, and then normal state zero, and then normal state one, and normal state two. Those are the textures of our bow in custom model data one. Let's edit them a bit. Uh, I will I will just edit it here. I will not open paint or paint.net or or Photoshop for edit. Let's go here and I don't know. Mm. Okay, black and white. Let's save this. Now this one. Did. Black and white. Save. Save. and save with this one what do we have okay we have that the bow in their normal state it will have the vanilla textures they are located here these are the vanilla textures and you can check them in the winner that we opened a while ago then if it has custom model data one it will search for these model files that are these ones and these models search for these textures and these textures are the ones that we put before this one let's check it let's go into a into a world i didn't create the pack.mc meta No problem. MC Meta. Let's create it. 24 for for this Minecraft version. And let's check if it's there. It's not. Oh, oh my bad. Sorry. Here. Perfect. Let's check. Um, bow, bow, the normal bow, it works perfect. Okay, let's check if it works. All right, one. Oh, this is not my keyboard. Sorry. Mm. Where? Oh, uh. no problem. This one. Sorry, this is not my my keyboard. Okay, we have the the black and white texture model. Perfect, it works. But for the custom model data two, we'll we will do another thing. How we're going to do it? Okay, let's close all these except the bow admin file one. This one. It says if it is custom model data 2 it will search for these files let's do it simple let's just copy this and paste them and for all that has copy i will put custom 2 for this custom 2 for this custom 2 and for this one too. 
Okay, so we have these four files that are the same files that the bow admin file is searching when it has custom model data two. Look, custom model data two. It search for item bow custom dos custom two bow custom two bow, and the same with the pooling states. So we have to edit these files now. These files are searching for a texture located here and they right now they are using the name the same textures as the black and white uh, model so let's copy this no I, I will I will get I will get the the bow normal again sorry versions I want the normal texture set minecraft texture item bow okay let's get them and they will be called i don't know um dmd bow and then dmd bow hero dmd bow one and cmd bow two Let's start opening them, and I don't know, you can edit them properly. <laughs> yeah, I'm just making a couple of changes. Okay, this. Save. Edit. Here. 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 Save. Here. Save and the final one. I will refresh this. I don't know why they have the white. Okay, no problem. So we have the textures, but the JSONs we created that are looking for when it has custom model data too, they are still using. The textures of black and white because we copy and paste it so we have to fix that custom 2 when it has custom model that 2 will be searched for cm2 cmd2 bow it's called like that cmd2 bow okay then cmd2 bow 0 cmd2 bow 1 and cmd bow CMD two bow two like that CMD okay this don't don't, don't have the two no problem I will add two two and two so again what is happening here models item bow the bow admin one if it has custom model data one, it will search for these four files. These four files search for these four textures. And it if and if it is custom model data two, it will search for these four model files. And these four model files will search for these four textures. Let's check if this works. Let's reload the texture pack because we made changes. Um, first of all, this works fine. This works fine. And now, custom model the two, it is more red. That is the change we made. And it works perfect. What if we want more textures? <laughs> okay, no problem. Let's copy all this part until here. Or you can add the comma because we will add the comma and here we will add a comma and paste and now we have another another texture that we want with custom model data 3 for example that is that is the way to to add more models we copy these and then paste again we have two custom model data four, 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 and four, and so on. You can create as many as you want. I hope I 
all your questions um, and you can create now multiple bowl textures. Have a nice day and